Martin Vizcarra is the new president of Peru. The 55-year-old former regional governor arrived in Peru on Friday from Canada, where he was Peru's ambassador. Addressing Peru's Congress, he said the country needed to move on. We are coming to the bicentenary of our nation in a situation of instability and institutional ruin, which no Peruvian could want. The time has come to say enough. His rapid appointment follows the shock resignation of Pedro Pablo Kuczynski on Wednesday. Kuczynski stepped down as he faced a new corruption scandal on the eve of a second impeachment vote for his alleged corrupt ties to Brazilian firm Odebrecht. Addressing the nation this week, he said he'd been the victim of a malicious campaign by the dominant political opposition. In the face of this difficult situation that has developed and has unjustly made me appear guilty of acts that I have not participated in, I think the best thing for the country is that I resign as president of the republic. The opposition released secretly filmed videos appearing to show members of his government and other allies trying to buy votes against the impeachment from opposition lawmakers. On Thursday, amid violent clashes with the police, scandal-weary Peruvians marched in protest, calling for all politicians to go. Given Peruvians' frustration with their political representatives, the incoming president's low profile could work in his favor. With a three-and-a-half-year term before him, this could be an opportunity to improve the political atmosphere. Dan Collins, CGTN, Lima.